Hey, it's Helen, and I want to show you how to set an eyelet and a grommet. And this is a bunch of grommets on a little um, notebook I carry in my purse. I call it the scroll and notebook. It's got a hair tie connector. I love attachments and connections and figuring out different ways to use them. So an eyelet is one piece. It's a tiny little metal piece. And they come in different sizes and shapes. This is even an eyelet with a decorative um, design on it. Uh, I'll list the links and the resources. These are from eyeletoutlet.com. And then a grommet is two pieces. So it's got the colored end and then a little piece that fits on the back of your material, your fabric, your paper. And... Um, they're both a little bit different. So I have a piece of Craftex here. That's what this is made with. Craftex is a paper that's really kind of like leather and you can sew it. It's sewn, it's uh, sold in fabric stores and specialty stores. Um, so this is a small piece of it. It's easy to cut with scissors. And to, um, to set the eyelet, you need, this is a Japanese screw punch, which is another wonderful tool where you can punch a hole anywhere in a sheet of paper. And it comes with different, um, I'll call them bits. So from teeny tiny up to about an eighth of an inch. And so this is the size that works well for this size eyelet. So then you place your eyelet face down on this little setting mat. Put your paper on top. You want to have your paper face down also because the other side will be the front. And then you put the setting tool on top and give this a couple of whacks. And it splays out that back so that it grabs the paper or the craft text. And then this could be a decorative element, but it also could be a place where you uh, connect a string or a wire. Let's set one of these flowers. Oop, that's how you change the bits. There we go, that one's splayed really nice. And I've got my flower on there. Enjoy. Okay, and then a grommet um, has very clear instructions right here too on how to set the grommet. It has its own hole punch that you hammer. So there's my hole. And then it's got this little tool that you put the, uh, the bottom piece in. So face down, fits um, into that little divot. And then, then your paper or whatever you're fastening to. And then this has, um, it's rounded on one side. The rounded side should be up. And then this has a similar looking tool, but it's different. It's got a hole that fits on top of here. And then I'll hammer that. And it actually pushes part of this piece up through and around to interlock. So that's a nice, that looks great. Have fun setting grommets and eyelets.